Hello Grill Masters, if you are seeing the LER error code on your trigger grill, don't panic. In today's video, we will explain what this error means and walk you through effective troubleshooting steps to get your grill back in action. Let's fire it up. Here's come the meaning of trigger grill error code LER. The LER error code on a trigger grill indicates a low temperature error. This occurs when the grill's internal temperature drops below 125 degrees Fahrenheit for more than 10 minutes, this safety feature automatically shuts off the grill to prevent further issues, especially during low and slow cooking processes. Step 1. Power cycle the grill. Turn off and unplug your grill. Flip the power switch to the on position or press the power button to the on position. Wait 30 seconds. Flip the power switch to the off position or press the power button, plug in and turn on the grill. Step 2. Check for non-technical issues. Weather conditions. Is it very cold or windy? This can affect cooking. Check out weather effects on grilling. For more details on weather impact, I have provided the link in the description. You can directly go through it. Starting procedure. Make sure you are starting the grill correctly. Check out how to start your trigger pallet grill to make sure you are on the right track. I have provided the link in the description. You can directly go through it and check it through. Inspect the fire pot. Remove grill grates and check for pallet. If empty, fill with new pallets. If too full, remove excess pallet and clean out ash and sawdust. Step 3. Clean the grill. Vacuum out ash and sawdust from the fire pot and hopper. Check your chimney height. I have provided the link in the description. You can directly go through it. You should be able to fit your thumb in the gap between the pipe and the cap. To adjust the height, just twist the cap. If there is build up or any blockage in the pipe, clean out the pipe to improve air flow. Step 4. Check mechanical parts. Plug in and turn on your grill to check for any unusual sounds from the fan or motor. Make sure all connections are secure, especially for the temperature probe, RTD and hot rod. If there's no heat or sound from the fan, you may need to replace those parts. Step 5. Adjust P settings. If your grill has a P setting feature, adjust it to a lower number to increase the auger speed. Step 6. Contact trigger support. If you follow these steps and still see the LER error, it may be best to contact Trigger Support for further assistance. I have provided the link in the description. You can directly go through it. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more videos, hit the subscribe button.